When my contraction started, they were on and off, and so I knew it wasn't something serious. I informed my sister-in-law and we agreed to monitor the situation. I even started my normal house chores and later we went to bed. At around 1 a.m., I woke up with intense pain from my abdomen. When I went to the washroom, I could feel as if the baby was coming out. My husband and I rushed to hospital. On our way, we found police officers who escorted us to the hospital and I delivered at 6 a.m. Soon after leaving the hospital, I started leaking urine continuously, which developed to obstetric fistula. My husband abandoned me and I had to stop selling tea because people were not comfortable staying around or near me due to the foul smell. For many women in the rural areas, they develop fistula when giving birth since they use traditional birth attendants who pull out the baby, often leading to tear of the birth canal. Others get this condition due to prolonged labor as there are no health facilities near them. When AMRF announced they were having a fistula camp at our facility, I mobilized all the women that I knew were suffering from fistula and they all came and successfully underwent the surgery. I am so happy when I see my patients healed and looking very happy and energetic, even younger and beautiful. AMREF Health Africa has really built our capacity as nurses in this facility through the numerous training we have had. We are now able to give better services to our patients. We wish AMREF to continue with this noble work. AMREF has been a key partner to the Ministry of Health for South Sudan. We have provided surgical, outreach surgical services to larger populations in the conflict and war affected areas during war. We have worked with them. We have performed obstetrical fistula repairs to over 180 women in the country. We have trained uh, almost 32 uh, medical staff on obstetric fistula surgery uh, together with the auxiliary uh, auxiliaries that is. And, and we pioneer now in comprehensive sexual education in the country for the youth as we move towards the, the so-called demographic uh, dividend for the youth. I am now completely healed after undergoing surgery and my husband is back. I am looking forward to having more children since they are a blessing from God. However, due to the surgery, I will wait for a few more years to forget the painful experience that I went through.